Rose. What a tune. Dude, he's got a beard. As it soaks you to the bone. Liam Gallagher's got his coat on. Man's not hot. That thing with him and those kids is quite cute this week, if you've not seen that. Be all the same as me. We'll see things they'll never see. Ah, he can't hit that note no more. Oh, that's sad. Oh, that's really sad. Not that I attempted it, but the fact he can't do it. Oh, that's just so sad. How you getting growls? Do you think he's got a bad back from standing like that all the time? Lately. Tally's here now, padding the blanket. He loves the sound, sweet nasal sounds of Liam Gallagher. Respecting victims of terrorist atrocities. Now's the time to find out why. Here we go. Come on, hit the note, Liam. Gonna live forever. Gonna live forever. That is quite tragic that he can't hit that note. Don't do drugs. I mean do if you want certainly did my fair share <laughs> that's why I can't sing either <laughs> he could, that's the highest key you can get to my friend Kate is going to kill me for slagging off Liam Gallagher <laughs> he looks like he's chewing gum as he walks off I thought Ariana Grande was going to perform. I'm sure she respects the work of Liam Gallagher. Uh, oh, is it another? Sorry. Okay, at least three people on Twitter have just said they're going to listen to this, so now I feel morally obliged to finish it. Fucking hell. Rowan's going to be mad at me because I forwards through Ed Sheeran, though. I feel guilty British now. But seriously. There's only the so much a woman can take. Who the fuck is Luke Evans? What happened to Lee Evans? I mean, not that I've missed him. What is this? What the fuck is that? I don't know how evil these people are. Oh my god, he's bellowing at this woman. What is that? I don't like her dress and I don't like his suit. Best, best British group. That? Oh, Wolf Allison. Overrated. Fake indie. Oh, God. I fucking hate gorillas. Shit. I don't even know who that is. I like the video, though. Good video. The XX. It's like I would like them, but too many other people like them, so it puts me off. <laughs> I'm such a snob. Royal blood. Uh, I might like a couple of theirs, I'm not sure. Sound like everything else, I can't tell. Uh, who's going to win that? And the winner for British group is... <gasps> Sorry. Who is it? Eh? Gorillas! Oh, Damon Albrown can't be bothered to turn up. 
I don't like the gorilla's music. I fucking hate that. It's duh. And I don't like the animation either. And I didn't understand what he just said in that acceptance video. Oh, Damon Albarn is there. Hold on. They're meant to be behind a screen or something. They're not meant to come up and be... Uh, you're meant to be like a hologram behind a curtain. It's like the Wizard of Oz coming out. Get back behind the... Uh-huh. It's an outfit. Whoa. There's women in the gorillas. I never knew that. I just think of Diamond Albrand. I need to get some my nurse. Why did they... Who voted for this? Who actually voted for that? No one. Bullshit. It annoys me because someone hacked into my Spotify account and listened to the gorillas and that fucking recommends them to me. Fuck off. That's probably how they won this fucking award. Bollocks! Crap! Rubbish! Oh, I've got no drink now. Um. Oh, he's so annoying. Bring back Alex James, all's forgiven. Part life. And it's about this country. <laughs> oh God. This country. Say the NHS. Believe it or not, quite a small little thing, right? Brexit. It's full of. It's a lovely place. I think Damon Alvin's oh, drunk. No. The others are talking amongst themselves behind him. It's like fucking super hands, man. What I want to say is, don't let it become isolated. Yeah. Don't let yourselves become. Uh, Brexit. Off, you know, All right, super hands. Go take some more crack. You know I mean? God, the others are like, fuck, can't we just thank Sony Records or something? You are politicking. Oh, they're saying that. Hold on, is he letting one of the others speak? Uh, nah. Hello, ah! I just want to say... They just tried to... to say, <laughs> the got on. They just tried to cut... Uh, they just tried... <laughs> they just tried to cut back to Jack Whitehall. Uh, then they just... just... Say, thank you, thank you, especially to the gorillas. Thank you, Dane, Jamie, everyone, the whole team for believing in me. Dreams do come true, man. Honestly, this is a blessing. Thank you, guys. Thank you. <laughs> they just switched the lights off on her. Hi everyone. Uh, look, they're all doing a speech. I love these guys. Oh, this is good. This is the best thing that's this is the best thing that's happened so far. They're all doing a speech. Ah, uh, whoever's on at the end is gonna get cut off. I love it. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Damon's still trying to switch his mic back on. <laughs> Congratulations to the Rollins! <laughs> I can speak all night if it was my choice. That was so good. That was so awkward. I think he was talking about Brexit. Hmm? Now, normally when relationships break down, it's all binge eating, crying, That was so cringe. Oh my god. Oh, that's the thing everyone's going to be so talking about. That was funny. Please welcome Brit, Grammy, you don't all get to talk gorillas. I didn't even see Sean Ryder up there. If you think I'm sitting through the whole of this, I've got another fucking thing coming. How long is left? That's like Sam Smith's going up to heaven. Lollipop, lollipop. He's got a lollipop head. I think he looked better when he was fat. Now I'm thin shaming. Honestly, I I would actually rather die than listen to the whole of this song. You think I'm exaggerating? This little cavern he's in, it's like something off of Mario Odyssey, which makes me want to play Mario Odyssey and not watch this. I don't like his suit, it's ugly, horrible colour, like diarrhea colour. Um, he's so earnest. He makes Ed Sheeran look like a rebel. 
Oh, fuck this one. Bye. Sorry, life's too short. Just ask the gorillas. <laughs> Just cut off the end of his song, please. Shite! If you like that, you need to rethink your life choices because that's awful. Fucking dreadful. A living legend currently performing his million dollar Elton John show at Caesar's Palace Las Vegas, a venue he calls Caesar's Palace. It's Sir Elton John. What? What's he doing? Swimming around in olive oil in his padding pool. And I'm so sorry I can't be there in person. Oh, no worries, mate. You weren't missed. Talk about one of my dear friends. But the very first time I heard this uh, I knew he'd hey? be a huge star across the world. Hey? Last year he played me his third album, Divide, in London, and I thought, Shape of You, Monster Hit. I was really Hold on, did he just say Ed Sheeran? <laughs> Ed Sheeran? <laughs> Ginger Vex Ginge, but can't pronounce names. Especially over the last months, Congratulations on what? You're the most deserved recipient of this year's Global Hobgoblin Award. <laughs> Least Sexy Ginger on the Planet Award. This past year, Ed third oh, you think I'm going to fucking sit through this shit? Alright, I will sit for a bit of it, just for being loud. 12.3 million global sales. Okay, well, millions of people voted for Trump, so... Oh, wearing a sombrero, cultural appropriation. Um, crap tattoos. Outstanding chart success has turned him into a global sensation, making him the most in demand artist on front covers and TV screens <laughs> around the world. He's currently on an epic two year world tour of wearing the same two Czech shirts over and over again. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I tried. I tried. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I tried. Apparently, Shape of You is the world's best loved single. Uh, but it didn't ask me on that survey. Thank you, Sir Elton. Thank you, Sir Ed Sheeran. Oof. A man who has claimed it for so long, <laughs> even he has to watch the in memoriam package each year to check he's not in it. It's a rock god. It's about living legend. Uh, just about living. Zing. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Jack White Whitehall is funny at times. I mean, God, imagine if James Corden was presenting this. I would not be doing this. Ugh. How old is Ronnie Wood? Oh my god, his hands look really spindly and thin. Ooh, weird. A few years ago, Ed performed with us in the States. Oh, are we still on about Ed Sheeran? Do oh, you know what I'm going to get? He was really great. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> in him, a prolific songwriter. Writer. A, a lovely young guy. Look, I'm going to keep it on, but I'm going to get go and get an orange squash, okay? We can still hear it. We can both still hear it. Both of us, me and my one listener. But, you know. Yeah, back to Ed. He doesn't get enough exposure, I find. He needs more people blowing smoke up his fucking ass, Up his ginger ass. Um, Let's is it his pop songs for idiots? No offence. I think my black old heart. Sorry, I'm just making an orange squash. I'm sure we didn't miss anything in Morton. Oh, here it comes. He's still got a red jacket on. Which one's his girlfriend? Pete Tong's there again. most overexposed pop star on the planet.